Bray House room tour, University of Edinburgh. All right, here it is. Front door, we lock thing, uh, light switch to that light. You also have that light switch over there that does the same thing. Um, this is just a small room. This isn't a large room. Um, I think the large room just has extra space between the bed and all that. So here you go, coat rack there, four pegs. You get a wee bit of shoe space or whatever you want it for down there. Um, you have three cupboard things, um, all the same size, like 50 centimeters, I think. I don't know, I didn't measure it properly, but that's how big it is. Can fit that, so, you know. Um, I've got my books up there. These ones are slightly longer, maybe like 60. I, I don't know, I'm not measuring that though. Um, so, I don't know, you can put your books up there, do whatever the fuck you want up there. Um, if you want to put a PC there, it's a good size for it. It fits fine. Um, not so much there. It's um, a bit cramped, but whatever. You get big pin board there. Um, again, pin whatever the fuck you want up there. And a bit of space there. Um, forever, whatever you want, laptop or whatever. Uh, you have these drawers. Three of. They're pretty bad drawers, but they're very loud as well. It's whatever. Big ass mirror there. Um, this thing, I didn't know this until um, maybe like a few months in. Uh, if you turn this off, it turns off your heating. Uh, so if you want the heating, it'll be turned off when you come in. If you turn that on, um, it doesn't say anything about heating here. But that's set to two hours. Um, you just hold it down and then your heating turns off after that amount of time. Um, this light switch here goes to the main light. Uh, that's connected to that switch over by the door. And that one is for these lights. Just underneath. I'll show you bathroom. Now, toilet there. Oh, coat, not coat rack, towel rack thing. Another one for your big towel. Another huge mirror. It doesn't have lights in behind it or anything. It's just off the wall a wee bit. Um, shower. You get that, that comes with. I got that from Ikea though, so. You don't get that. It's quite useful though. Um, sink there. Lots of space down there. I guess you could put like a wee, you know, a few drawers or something there if you like. And toilet paper down there. Um, I'm, I'm moving out, so my bed's not clean, but you know. Get this wee uh, cabinet space behind your bed. Um, it's a three-quarter size bed, which is like really awkward to find covers for, but you know, it's whatever. Uh, you get all that. Um, three-quarter size bed. You get this down here. This is broken. It, it was broken when I moved in. Uh, you get under bed space. I don't use it for anything though. That's broken. It just falls down by itself. Um, can be arse getting it fixed. You get two of, two of them. Um, shit down there. There's a radiator. If you want to make sure the heating's on, turn it on there. I'll turn it off now. Um, and set the value. I, I always had it on 30 because I want to get my money's worth. Um, there you go. That's all my shit because I haven't taken it out yet. Coat rack there. And you get all this space here. Another thing there. All of that. Plus that wee bit up there. Um, don't know what else there is really. I'll show you the kitchen. So here's the kitchen here. 
walk-in looks like this. Every, every kitchen is different though, I mean, uh, I'm ground floor. Uh, so, it's pretty shit actually, this, this road's quite loud. People like to use it as like a drag strip at night. Um, uh, seagull. Yeah, people use, like to use it as a drag strip at night. So, uh, yeah, lots of loud cars coming by. Um, lots of people walking by at night as well. So, depending on the flat, I'm in a six person flat. Um, I get two sinks, two fridges, two freezers, uh, two hobs, two ovens, one microwave. And the place doesn't come with anything else. So, that's our own. That's our own, and that's our own. Um, you get one, two, three, four, five, six. Six cabinets. So that's mine there, just got a bunch of shit in it. You've got all that there. Again, those are really shitty drawers. And that stuff there. Um, we get this wee camper top area, which is quite nice. Um, bins are awful. I hate the bins. Um, the food waste bin didn't work at all, especially during summer. Uh, just, you know, had a bunch of flies and maggots, so we stopped using it. Get two couches, one little countertop thing. You get a TV as well, but it's got like BBC and that's about it. Uh, so I just brought along a uh, Chromecast and use that instead. Um, I'll show you the fridges, I guess. There you go. Everyone's moved out except me, so <laughs> it's only my stuff. I'm only here for the day and then I'm moving out. So that's my tea and um, yeah, that's all I've got. Freezer, four drawers. The fuck? Oh. And my flatmate's giving me some food. That's nice. I'm taking that home with me. Uh, that's pretty much it. So I made this video because there's like only two videos on YouTube. Um, one of them is really shit and I got nothing from it. And um, the other one, it was just a girl crying because she had to move up. So um, I made this video to hopefully be more useful. If you've got questions, ask. Um, uh, in the summer, when you move in, um, what, in September? It's going to be really fucking hot outside, or at least it was for me. It's going to be really hot, and these rooms get, like, sweltering uh, during the summer. Um, I have my windows open at all times. Um, so, well, only one window, only one window opens. It, it cracks open like that a tiny bit. Um, doesn't do much. You can get fans from reception if you really want, for free. Um... There's, the reception people are all nice. Uh, Tommy is the best. If you see Tommy, um, tell him Joseph says hi. Um, so yeah, pretty good, pretty good location, I, I guess. Um, I mean, the walk to uni is a bit shit. It's, it's straight up the Royal Mile, so it's all uphill. Um, takes about half an hour to walk to uni. Uh, George, George Square. You can just get a shuttle bus to Kings if you need. Um, but yeah, it's uh, it's not that bad of a walk. Um, it's just you know all uphill. That's the only downside about it. Um, what else is there to say? In the winter, temperatures fine because you've got the heating. So um, I always had it on, and I was always boiling because I wanted to get my money's worth out of the flat, so, um, yeah, that's about it though, um, there's not really much more to say, I don't think, about the flat, um, 
Yeah, that's about it. Thanks for watching.